Hello everyone, Amanda Holmes here, CEO of Chat Holmes International, and you have your weekly dose of the ultimate sales machine. If you are watching on video, you can see that I have a beautiful landscape behind me. Even in the far, you can see the Swiss Alps. So I am in Switzerland, uh, right on the border of Italy, in Lugano, if you ever get the chance to go, I highly recommend it, it is so gorgeous. For anybody that actually likes designer brands, there is this outlet mall that has 250 designer brands that are all 50 to 70% off. It was ridiculous how much money I spent in such a short period of time. So what I'm talking about today is something that I had a conversation with a gentleman uh, at the event that I was speaking at yesterday. So I spoke for the Illu Illuminati Club. Yeah. Frank Miranda's Illuminati Club. It's a mastermind. It's not the Illuminati. Uh, and I will be making it back to America. Uh, so I was talking with a gentleman who was actually the translator for the event. He was translating everything I was saying into Italian, Mike. And he had actually translated my father at Business Mastery oh, 12, 15 years ago. So it did give me a shed of a uh, tear. But he said to me, he said, you know, I'm, I believe he's in his, you know, probably early 60s. And he said... I've never really been native to social media. He didn't grow up with it. He felt very uncomfortable going on social media and posting. And he brought this to me saying, you know, I, I just don't understand how I can use social media. And it's frustrating for him because he sees that other people are using it, but he just finds it so hard to post. And me knowing that salespeople who use social outsell their peers by 78% and knowing that prospects are 80% more likely to talk over social media than to pick up a phone and dial a sales rep today. So I know how critical this piece is. So we were talking and I, and I recommended that because with sales, right, it's better it, you're you truly have picked up the art when you're listening more than you're speaking and you're able to ask questions that evoke the response of wanting to buy rather than just telling them. And the famous line of be more interested than interesting, I recommended that he pick a select few because he's a, a translator, right? So it's not like he needs 5,000 clients, but he probably has a couple that he has already worked with in the past or ones that he would like to work with in the future. And I told him to follow them on social and to just spend, allocate one hour a week to go and look at those profiles and comment on whatever they post and like whatever they post and just be interested in that person. To him, it was a huge relief. He looked... 15 pounds lighter. And by the end of the session, he came back to me and he said, I've already found three prospects and I've commented on a couple of their posts already. And what I found is I don't even have to pitch my services. All I'm doing is that I'm showing that I am reliable. I'm showing that I care. I'm showing that I'm consistent because if I'm consistently commenting, they feel that I am relevant and top of mind because the number one goal of marketing is to be top of mind, right? You're creating top of mind awareness. And that is the point of social is to create top of mind awareness. So why wouldn't you allocate for those that you know are better buyers, right? Dream buyers or those that are worth the time to spend. You're not just going on social and flicking through for hours. You're being very diligent and focused about who you're responding to. And then if they post something about their family in a picture, you should say something nice. You know, oh, I can't believe Billy's that old. Look at how much he's grown. Uh, if they post about their business, congratulations. So great to see that, right? So we're just starting conversations. And what does everybody want on social? They want validation. They want people to like and comment on their posts. So they're already looking for that validation. Why wouldn't you give it to them? So there is just a little gold nugget be more interested than interesting and go ahead and do some social listening on and come back and tell me how it goes hey eh? because what i found is i become more interested in those that i want to work with 
and they end up coming to me asking for my services rather than me having to pitch them. That is the art of social selling. So until next week, enjoy. Make sure to get your copy, your copies, at theultimatesalesmachine.com. There's a lot of special bonuses that you can't get going to Amazon, so make sure you check it out at ultimatesalesmachine.com.